right now. So, so our, our role here at NIH is to ensure the strongest possible biomedical research workforce in the world. And the only way we're going to do that is if everybody is included in the opportunity and conversation to, to engage in this. And there are some groups, sexual and gender minorities, members of other represented groups in science, who have a reluctance to, to engage, to, to participate. And rather than sort of sitting back and waiting, and then if somebody pokes their head out and says, okay, okay, yeah, sure, you, I think we have to be more proactive in establishing an environment that's incredibly welcoming and unambiguous in, yes, we really do want you to engage because of the unique perspectives that you bring to problem solving, um, you know, solution arriving at, and so forth. Um, that's what this is about, and it's actually a very valuable way to look at it because it gets people, you know, to, to do something as opposed to be passive and just sort of wait. Because if you wait, it's opportunity lost. If you wait, you're going to lose talent. If you wait, you're not going to achieve the full potential either of the individuals who have so much to offer, but as importantly, the, the ultimate goal of what the agency is, which is to improve health.